Hi everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a review on this fragrance here, which is Sailing Day by Replica. Um, now I have actually done another video on this same brand, so if you would like to see that, definitely go back in my channel and you will find it. Um, so exactly like the other one, straight up the packaging. I absolutely love their packaging. I think it is so cute, so cool, and definitely something that I personally like love to display in my makeup room or in my bathroom. I just think it looks really cool. I love the bottle shape. I love the automizer and the whole lid, and I love the fabric label. I just... I haven't seen anything similar to it, so I was really drawn to it the second I saw it. So just on the label, it just says replica, originally sailing day. Province and period is Paros 2001. A fragrance description is aquatic deep blue and style description is male and female fragrances. Um, so this one as well is a 100ml bottle and this retails for $180 and is sold in Mecca in Australia. So I don't know if you can get this anywhere else but Mecca is where this was purchased. So just going through the notes just to give you a better idea of what this smells like. Top notes, uh, sea notes, alahides, red pepper, coriander. Middle notes are juniper. Amel, Ceciliate, Iris and Rose, and base note is Seaweed, Cedar, Ambergris, and Amberwood. So, as always, the Automizer Test. This one is super, like, sharp. It just, yeah, it's just very thin, very narrow spritz, and just shoots out quite... I want to say forcefully, but it's not that bad. It's just quite like it's just there. Um, now this smells like very clean. Um, you can definitely smell the seaweed note coming through. It's so slight, but it's also very prominent. Uh, this fragrance for me is definitely a hit and miss. It is very mood dependent. Sometimes I'm like, mm, I just, I'm not sure. And other days I'm like, I absolutely love this. I'm going to wear this like for days in a row. Um, so I know that that's not very helpful, but yeah, it's sort of clean, seaweedy, maybe a touch of woody notes, but like very so slightly. There's nothing that really hits you in your face that you just are like, oh my god, that smells like that. This one smells nothing like any other fragrance I have smelt personally, so I can't compare it to that. Um, but yeah, I do like it, but it is very mood dependent, to be honest. This one, along with other um, scents in this line, I do find that they also last all day. They really have great staying power. My dog is snoring behind me, so if you can hear that, I'm so sorry. Um, but would I recommend this? I would, um, but I probably wouldn't recommend buying it for someone if you don't know specifically what fragrances they like, or specifically if you are not sure if they like this one. I think it's a little bit of a risk because it is quite different. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this helpful. And as always, I will see you in my next video very soon. Thanks again. Bye.